Hey kiddos, Miss Cossack here. I just wanted to say congratulations on finishing the school year. I wanted to play a few games with you before you go for this summer. The first game we're going to play is called Accuracy Toss. You will need a pair of socks and a laundry basket for this game. The first thing you need to do is grab a laundry basket and set it against the wall. Then you need to find some random objects from around the house and spread them out in a straight line. At the end of the line, you need to have some kind of couch or big comfy chair. That's going to be your winner's chair. In order to win, your last toss needs to be made from the winner's chair. Now before you can play this game, you also need to get a pair of socks and roll them up into a ball, just like so. We are going to be tossing this pair of socks into the laundry basket. Check out my game. I have one request from you. Each time you make a shot, I want you to show off your winner dance move to your friends and family. Here are my moves. Man, my shots are so good, you don't even see them go into the basket. But I guarantee you, I am shooting. Notice with each shot that I make, I go back one object. If I miss my shot, then I have to go forward one space. Just like so. I missed that shot, so now I'm going to go back to the space that I was at before. Now I can move back. With each toss, I get closer and closer to the winner's chair. I think I have maybe one or two more shots left. Swish! Alright, I definitely have one last shot. But in order for me to win at this game, I have to make it from the winner's chair. Ah, uh, I didn't make it, therefore I did not win. So, I have to get my sock and go back one more space and try to make it from there. If I miss it from that space, then I have to go up another space. I'm going to call it quits for now, but I wish you luck on winning. If you want to be even more challenged, then try this variation of the game. You will need one coin and one cup. Just like before, my goal is to get to the winner's chair. I have to make it from the chair in order to win. Ah, I finally made my first shot. Now I can move back to the second object. If I don't make it, then I have to go back to the first object. And I didn't make it, so I'm going back to the scissors. Scooty, scooty, scoot, scoot. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Man, if I had a quarter for every shot that I made, ooh, I'd have 50 cents right now. Going back. Oh, this is gonna be hard. I already have a bad feeling about this. Yeet! Ah! So, like I said, this is going to be a more challenging version. If you thought that tossing the sock into the basket was hard, well, this is like boss level. This is like 10 times harder. But you can do it. And the purpose of this game is to develop your accuracy skills. You might not be good at tossing coins and socks. I'm not too good at it either, but I'm sure with the more practice I have, and the more practice you have, we can be better tossers. For this last activity, we will be jumping over hurdles. Hurdles are just obstacles. I will be making my hurdles out of toilet paper. You can use paper towels, or maybe pillows, or something soft. Um, I would encourage you to find some soft things to jump over, because if you're jumping over things like bricks, or buckets, it's going to hurt if you fall. So I went ahead and I stacked six rolls of toilet paper, and I'm pretty confident I can jump over this with ease. I actually used to run in track when I was in high school. Um, I ran in relays and raced against other fast people, and I also did hurdling, which is what you're seeing right now. Our hurdles looked a lot different. We didn't have toilet paper. <laughs> so I'm just testing to see how high I can get my hurdles to go without knocking over any of the rolls of toilet paper. So far, I'm at eight. This is nine. This is getting a little tricky. This is actually at my hip level, maybe slightly above my hip. 
and I need a really far running start. Here we go. Yeah, I think it counted. I'm pretty sure I went over it. Whoop whoop. I'm gonna put on this final, final roll of toilet paper. This is number 10. Let's see if I can do it. Guys, I haven't done this in years. Here we go. Hey! I think, uh, I think my butt may have nicked the top roll of toilet paper. I got a good wipe out of that. <laughs> I'm gonna try it again and see if I can do it two times in a row. Ah, not quite. I knocked that 10th one down. But hey, that's okay. Yeah, that was pretty exhausting. <laughs> I need to take a break. So what you need to do is send me a picture or a video of you doing each activity and submit it to Class Dojo. I will create a project for you and you can upload your videos from there. At the end of the week, all the specials teachers will come together and we'll judge and see who our winners are and we'll make sure to give you a shout out. Good luck and I hope you have a fantastic summer.